So today we show you um, one of my uh, old song. Uh, it's not under the name of Val Green. Val Green. It's under my uh, own name, Sébastien Duhamel. You can find it on um, on all the streaming platform like Spotify. Um, I wrote it for um, for um, French TV. Uh, it uh, it featuring in uh, some doc documentaries. Um, so the, um, but what I wanted to show you, you can do nice things with uh, easy, easy, easy leaks, easy lines, um, not too much uh, notes. So the idea here is I took uh, two chords, so E and a B, and I um, I wanted to play in Legion and not in uh, in, uh, in major. What I mean by that is that the, the E major Legion scale have an augmented fourth, so it really sounds more jazzy. Or for, if you want, it's like it's the same notes than, than in the B uh, major scale. So if it's, it's okay, so I have uh, my main uh, riff. So I take uh, an E, and here it's, the, it's a major third. And I'm descending to the second, and I arrive to the, it's a, it's a B, um, it's a B chord, because it's B and it's a major third. So, and some slide I will put the tab on my Patreon if you have um, if you want to see closer what I did with a uh, strumming hand uh, and then so I put the melody above um, the two chords so what I often did is to, to play, um, I, I did a loop with the two chords and then um, I try to find a melody. So the idea here, I start from the roots and I do a descending melody. And the nice thing is uh, when you're descending from the roots, uh, major 7, major 6, and um, the fifth, uh, the fifth it's a B. So it's a D uh, because. My goal was was to to go to the B chords, and I had a root. I had a, a, mi, a low E. Not the root. I, I think I said the Mi um, because it's the Do Re Mi Fa Sol La Si Do system. Sorry, uh, so E. And then again, um, I do uh, a descending um, melody but from the fifth of the E. So it's a fifth augmented fourth. So this note, is, it's, um, it means that we are in Legion, in major Legion and not in major union. So, and we arrive to the fifth of the B, which are the second of E. Um, um, yes. <laughs> so it's, Very easy because it's the same uh, frets as 9, 8, uh, 6, and 4. And when I arrived at 4, the first time uh, took only uh, these two, and um, the second time it's uh, lower. Okay, and then so it's. Uh, and sometimes I, I strum, uh, I pick more the, the E strings. I think the first time. Uh, I play it only once, and second time um, um, I eat uh, more. And then for the B, I strum roll too. So it's important to make uh, relief uh, in in your song. Uh, 
I mean, um, I mean, yeah. I don't like to, to play two times the, the same thing. It's, it's nice to like here to, to play uh, the first um, the first loop uh, qu quiet and then add more notes because just after you've got the chorus, so you, you need the intensity to uh, you need to build up build up uh, your parts to. Um, to make you feel that uh, there's something else after. So the next part, so I took a triad. So you, um, it's easy to find nice, uh, nice parts with triads. So here it's a E uh, triads from the C shape. So um, you need to, to know your cage system to find a triad. Uh, so I just pull off the, um, the root and I play only on a D, G, B. And again, you see uh, the tab to, to, uh, to look at the pattern. And here it's a um, B trial from the A shape of B. So do that. And I just uh, add a different note, it's a fourth of a B. Go back to the main riff. And for the second verse, um, I wanted to, to add some more intensity, so I apply the, the notes with um, the octaves. So it's the same, so I just add um, my finger here on the A string, so it's uh, the same note, two E's. So I play the low E too. And right to the B. But then it was um, here if I wanted to play the octave like that, uh, I don't have um, the low E anymore. So I find this here. So I get the low E in back. And it was not nice to to, do, uh, to play the B here. It's too far. So here, because I wanted to to hear that. second part again I wanted to, to do it more intense so I took uh, the same triad but I just add the, a low E the open E and here it's a, it's a B chord and the same thing with, uh, with um, the fourth So the thing here is, is you don't need uh, too much things to do uh, nice melodies uh, and you can do easy things. It's just a descending uh, melody with all the scale uh, notes. That's two descending uh, uh, melodies and um, only two chords and uh, not too much uh, strings uh, at one time. There are a lot of uh, space uh, between thing, things and um, play triads. It's nice, only three notes. Um, so, so that's all. Uh, I hope you find it uh, inspiring, or um, I like when you when I can give uh, some uh, composing ideas. Uh, so let me know what you think, and uh, see you next time.